Hey guys, welcome back to Vito's Garage. Thanks so much for watching and tuning in. Before we start this video, I just wanted to talk to you about this uh, really cool YouTube channel. It's called Honda Yamaha Fan. And uh, really, really like this channel and just wanted to, um, you know, recommend for you guys to go uh, to that channel and actually subscribe and watch their videos. It's actually really, really cool. Uh, two guys, their names are Blake and Andrew. They're really, really cool. They're doing a bunch of uh, interesting videos uh, related to cars, uh, mopeds and what have you. It's really, really cool stuff. And it's not just, it's actually a variety of everything. Uh, there's actually, in their videos, they have classic Mercedes, they have classic uh american cars and a bunch of other interesting stuff so i really really recommend for you guys to go and check out their channel uh if you guys would like to please go up here in the in this link uh and subscribe to the channel uh and also just so you know andrew he also loves uh classic uh, mercedes a lot and he actually reached out to me and he showed me that uh he has uh, you know a couple of classic Mercedes uh, one of them is a W126 which is a really cool car and he's been you know taking care of that car and he also loves saving those cars so please uh, go to their, their channel and support those guys actually really fun just fun watching watching them rebuilding some stuff and ma or making things uh, better on you know whether it's a vehicle or something else that they're working on their projects and what have you but yeah um please go ahead and look up their channel uh, it's gonna be also down in the description box so thanks so much guys and let's get started what an amazing car Alright, before our trip, we're gonna rotate this side tires because they're kind of bad. <laughs> this side actually is bad. Alright, so we're gonna put this in the front. The front one is actually pretty bad, yes. The car still needs an alignment, still needs more suspension work, but on the inside, it's it's getting worn. Eh, brakes are okay, your orders don't look the best. Your axles are still fine. Now let's do this. That's what I'm talking about, it's worrying on the inside. Okay, we'll put this in the back. Yeah, I gotta do the control arm bushings, gotta do these. These are all trashed suffering mounts. Oh, so much work. All right, tires are rotated. We're gonna go ahead and start driving this amazing machine. And you will see where we're going with this car. a good amazing car all right let it warm up we're gonna start driving to make a long story short there's a w124 mercedes 300e that's been sitting for like six years and i'm trying to go and look at it and probably maybe bring it home i don't know it hasn't run uh i need to talk to the lady it's an old lady uh, she owns that car so we're gonna go and check it out it's like a little over an hour away so yeah, saving these amazing old school machines. Hopefully you're doing the same thing. All righty guys, she's driving. She's such an amazing car. 
man there's still so much work left to do on this car uh, I need to find patience and time but she's running and driving amazingly yeah window open super cool lovely machine uh, we have to go pick up a part really quick and then after that we're gonna be on our way These are the cars that deserve the most attention. Not these stupid new cars, only these. Let's go pick up some parts. All right, picked up the part. All right, the reason I picked up the valve cover gasket is for a Honda. The lady wants me to replace her valve cover gasket, so that's what we're doing. Alright guys, we are rolling in this amazing machine. I filled her up a little and we're gonna go on our way. Just smooth sailing. Love this boat. Man, everybody is looking at me, watching me, giving me thumbs up, asking me about this car. I feel so damn good. <laughs> Can't do that with a brand new car. guys we have about like 20 miles left we'll be there in a little bit and I'm super excited just enjoying these amazing views of Washington State super beautiful Yeah, it looks like this one is missing here. Okay. Da, da, da. Well, guys, there she is. There's a lot of stuff missing on it. Yeah. Oil is there. Coolant is not there. So, oh man, there's a EZO module is missing, which is right there. Ignition coil is missing too. Spark plug wires are missing. Right there, wow. Just the inside. Oh my gosh. Gotta save this machine. 
It's been sitting for like six years. Man, tires are bold. Carefully lift it up. This valve cover hasn't been off for a long time. Everything is crusty. The gasket and everything has been leaking. So I'm just going to be replacing it for the lady. That way I can get that bends right there. She just needed some help with her Honda. So we'll see how it works. And I'm going to show you the bends a little more. That's how bad this valve cover gasket is. It's just caked on, cracked right there. So bad. I gotta replace these round gaskets, seals for the spark plugs. It's gonna be a pain to take them off. So finally, had to use the hammer, the screwdriver. I was able to pound all these out. I'm just gonna clean the rest of this residue, clean the valve cover from the inside and outside. But uh, this is how bad these are. They're not even pliable. All right, the weather has changed. <laughs> and now get new seals, I'm about to install them on here. And they were nice and pliable. And the gasket. All right, guys, there's an amazing machine. Bunch of parts missing off of it. Been here for six years. Oh boy, what an amazing car. The history, history, history. Needs lots of love. It's a bunch of trash and everything here. locked started raining all of a sudden and snowing a little bit <laughs> boy it's got a little bit of damage here sadly yeah Clean a little. That's okay, no worries. I'll clean it here in a sec. All right. It's almost like you get that satisfaction, you know, when you clean the car. Oh, oh look like at that. that. Feeling, All yeah. the dirt is coming off. I yeah. sort of, I did a little bit of it the other day. Yeah, no worries. Tree for That's it. okay. So you wouldn't have to climb through the tree. There you go. A little bit at least here. Ooh, 
uh, I was going to remove this panel, but now I decided I'm not going to just remove three, three bolts off of this latch. I'm just trying to free, uh, free this thing up using a PV blaster. Like I said, the car sat for a long time. Oh, guys, yeah, I'm just working on this W124 really quick. I'm just trying to get it ready. There's exhaust, actually. She told me that somebody tried stealing a, a catalytic converter off of this car, but she, they, she caught them and chased them off. So uh, the exhaust is actually laying down, so I have to uh, attach it. And I'm actually soaking this latch and PV blaster now and actually it's starting to work a lot better slowly but surely so I'm just soaking this baby all right before you close the trunk make sure that this all right this latch is now make sure that this actually comes back it's still a little difficult but it's working now cool good my baby timing chain where you at I can't feel it from here actually Uh, so there's another problem right here is this exhaust uh, I didn't bring the zip ties, but I need to like somewhat reattach it So Okay, I'm gonna use like a duct tape for now yep. Ooh, So much fun, but I'm about to show you the exhaust is back on The exhaust is back on and yeah, this is looking horrible, but I have to do it. Okay. So, I'm just gonna hold on right now. It's gonna be fine. All right, guys, so I'm not picking up the car today. Um, I think we're gonna get the car towed at some point later. Uh, lady is gonna help me. Uh, yeah, I just wanted to come here, fix her Honda, and get this car ready for the transport. This, as you know, the exhaust was off and everything, so. Uh, it really sucks, because I wish I could, uh, you know, I wish I brought the 27 millimeter socket to turn the engine by hand i really don't want to crank it i was gonna actually hook up my jumper and crank it but i don't want to do that so i'm just gonna leave it as is in the future i'm gonna actually remove the spark plus put oil in the cylinders and then i'm gonna try to start this car up that way yeah oh my gosh can't wait to see this car back to life Let's see if we can see what's the date on the tires uh, you can't really actually yeah 2006 is the date on these tires funny isn't it man what an amazing machine i need to see this car back on the road look at that oil filter it's all rusty that's ah, crazy Well, we're finally home, guys. Just came to grab some stuff from Walmart, but she is an amazing machine. Gotta tell you that she made the trip over there and back, no problem. I love this machine. They really don't make them like they used to. Yeah, there's still a bunch of work I gotta do to this baby, but that's gonna be coming up.